Hi everyone, Mike from CCTV Camera Pros here. Today I'm gonna to show you how to set up mobile push notifications using the Viewtron security camera system at my house. I'm gonna use that Viewtron IP camera that you see behind me. I have it connected to a Viewtron NVR upstairs in my loft, and I'm gonna set up an intrusion zone right here around my front door area so that when someone comes into this area, I get a push notification on the iPhone app. It works the same for Android. I'm gonna run you through this setup on the NVR software first and then do a demo of the whole thing. Let's get started. I'm logged into my NVR now and this is a live view of all my security cameras. This camera that monitors my front door, this is the one that I'm gonna set up the intrusion zone for that'll send me the push notification. I select settings from the main menu and then go into the AI slash event area. From here, I'm gonna select people vehicle detection and then the front door camera is already selected and the type of alarm I'm setting up is intrusion. First thing I do is check this enable detection by IP camera box. And then I can draw the intrusion zone uh, and I'm using the mouse that's connected to the NVR uh, just by pointing and clicking and connecting these dots. So there's my intrusion zone and I'm gonna hit apply. And then next I click on this trigger mode tab and then I wanna make sure that push is checked and I also check a uh, snapshot and click apply. Next, I'm gonna go into the push notification area so that I can tell the NVR what schedule I want the push messages sent on. First thing is I enable push notifications here and then you can see, you can set up, there's some default schedules like 24 seven, weekdays, weekends, and then you can set up custom schedules as well. For this test, I'm just gonna set uh, up uh, 24 by seven uh, detection and uh, just run a quick test and make sure communication with the push server is working and then I can X out of there. Next, I'm gonna enable push notifications in the mobile app. To do this, I tap on the configuration icon in the upper left and then select push setting. By default, all these will be unsubscribed or turned off. Uh, the home remote is the device I'm using and this is the state you'll most likely find yours in by default. And to enable push, you want to put that slider on. And then if you want a live view of the camera when you get the push notification, select live here. Or if you want it to go directly to recorded playback, you could select remote playback. I, I prefer live. And when you're done, tap on that disc icon to save your settings in the upper right. Then tap the back arrow and the back arrow again and the settings will be saved and push notifications are now enabled. Last, let's do a test of the push notification now that it's set up. I'm gonna approach the front door and I'm gonna put my iPhone over here on the left-hand side of the screen. And you'll see as I cross into the intrusion zone, I get the push notification on my phone. And then when I tap on the push message, it opens up the app in the live security camera view, just as we configured it. And there we go, test well done. I wanna mention a couple other things about push notifications before I wrap up this video. Uh, first of all, that was a 4K IP camera at my front door that I was using, uh, traditional IP camera, not AI. Uh, if you've been watching the other videos on the channel or following me, you know I've been making a ton of videos about uh, AI cameras that are also IP cameras, but they have built in artificial intelligence, uh, specifically object detection. Uh, why am I bringing that up? Uh, the non-AI cameras, like the one I was just using, that's using, that's using video motion to detect when someone uh, intrudes into those detection zones. But what's even more reliable is if you use one of our AI cameras and do human object detection uh, going into an intrusion zone. Also, in addition to intrusion detection, you can use any of the alarms built into these Viewtron systems uh, for, for triggering a push notification. Uh, for example, if you wanna set up an external alarm sensor using the alarm inputs on the DVR, for example, a passive infrared motion detector or a window or door sensor, you can use the alarm inputs on the DVR to also trigger alarms, uh, one of which type could be a push notification like we just did. 
Uh, I'll be making more videos about this. It's, it's a lot to cover. These Vutron systems uh, have a ton of features built in and also the DVRs with the BNC cameras, you can configure push notifications on those as well. Also directly from IP cameras if you're not using a recorder. If you want to learn more about this, first off, feel free to email me anytime. You can reach me directly at mike at cctvcamerapros.net. If you want to learn more specifically about push notifications with these Vutron systems, please visit www.cctvcamerapros.com slash push. Thank you for watching.